Hey, I hope you're doing great. I'm Fer, and in today's video, I will share with you five tapping exercises that your neighbors will hate, but you will love. Tapping hit the rock scene in the hands of a tremendously gifted musician, the master himself, Eddie Van Halen, and later evolved with players like Steve Vai and Joe Satriani. From simple phrases to extremely complex licks like the ones played by Jennifer Batten or Stanley Jordan, tapping can cover a lot of fretboard territory. So let's play! This first exercise is in D major and it includes a dual tap on each string. I use both my fingers, the second and the third one for the taps. And one thing that's very important, every time you go up a string, this note is tapped here. It's actually not played with the pick. Tip number one, coordination of both hands is crucial, so start slowly and work each string at a time. This example is also in the major and it involves playing open strings, the third and the fourth string, and there's also a slide here. It will also make a great intro for a song. Tip number two, define which finger or fingers you're comfortable using. For example, I don't tap with my index finger because I hold my pick with it, so I use fingers two, three and four. You'll see some players holding the pick like this and tapping with the index finger. This third exercise is great to work on your tapping slides. Focus on how the slides sound. The tap notes on the slides must sound clean and fluid. Tip number three. Try to memorize the notes you'll play with the fretting hand and keep your sight on the tapping hand. Here's another great exercise to practice your slides. And it's a proof that this technique can also be used in a more melodic way. Tip number four, don't rush the tap note. They have to sound as clean and loud as the other ones. In this final exercise, you can use one or two fingers to do the tapping, it's up to you. One finger, two fingers. You can also tap different notes and move across the neck. Tip number five, watch videos of Eddie Van Halen, Steve Vai or Joe Satriani playing live. Some of them have great close-ups of their hands playing. Use YouTube Hub Speed function and see what these players do and how they are doing it. Although it was extremely overused in the 80s, tapping is fun and if used sparingly, it can add a lot of variety and expression to your playing. If you want to keep improving your playing, watch this video and I'll see you next time.